Hi there, Paul from The Church Go here. Today I'm gonna to give you a real quick demo of our platform and what it's capable of. So when you sign up for The Church Co, you get given this dashboard. And this is everything you need to manage your digital ministry. You can manage your account with us, your mobile app, you can quickly edit your homepage. We have tons of tutorials. Um, and so I just wanted to break down what each of these are and what they do. We'll do it very quick. So the pages list out all the pages on your website. You've got your blog posts, your upcoming events, your sermons and your podcast, all of your photos, some stock photos to use, forms to help people register for events or sign up for youth camp, um, changing your design, your menus. You can have announcements and banners on your site. You can manage your people and staff. You can have connect groups, manage your members, their prayer requests. You can set up sermon notes. Um, to have outlines for when people watch church online or follow along through a past sermon in your archive. You can map custom domains, um, manage admins of the website and give them access to only specific areas like let the youth pastor only manage the youth page. Um, you can set up a little chat messenger um, and as well as we have tons of integrations with services like Planning Center, PushPay, Church Community Builder, Church Suite, all of these, these good things. Um, so it's a lot to, to, to go over but um, one thing to keep in mind is if you ever get stuck, um, we have a whole team of people that are right here that you can send us a message. Um, we have help docs as well and a great YouTube channel um, that lets uh, you get tutorials and learn everything about the platform. But if you're ever stuck, just send us a message and we usually get back to you pretty quickly. Um, so I wanted to jump in. So first thing to look at, we've got um, your homepage, right? So this is how our page builder works. You'll notice you've got the um, website preview here and the content on the left and they all line up right welcome welcome we're glad you're here we're glad you're here the image if you ever want to swap these things around add buttons it's all very simple um, we've separated the design from the content and the reason we do that is so that anyone in your church can make changes without fear of the website shifting its design like you know when you move an image in a word document and the whole thing gets out of whack that's never gonna happen here um, so if, if you wanted to add a third image to this row, you could just open this up, go to the images tab, um, click add new, and, um, and it would add a new image. Now one really cool thing about our platform is everything is mobile responsive and it does it automatically. You don't have to add or adjust anything. So um, when we go down and look at the mobile view here, these are going to automatically stack and make sure that this looks great on a phone. Um, so it's very simple to add and edit um, and um, we've got a whole thing of of options here um, that you can uh, choose from. So um, all of these different little layout options like add your Instagram feed, a giving form, accordions, a prayer request system, that's all built directly into the platform and it all is set up to look beautiful. Um, so keep continuing on, keeping this quick, um, sermons are a huge part of church. So one of the features we have is a sermon series layout. So you can upload your latest sermons, feature them, um, lay them out on the page, let people click into them, navigate, search, all of that. Um, so just showing how to add those real quick. This is a sermon. You can see we've given it a title um, of uh, Salt and Light. You can see that there. We've added it into the category of the series like Sermon on the Mount. We've added an image. We've attached the YouTube video. Um, added a button to link over to iTunes. And we even connected these sermon notes so that people could follow along. The, the real cool thing here is now, if I miss the sermon, I can click play here and I can follow along and take notes um, while, as if I'm watching the sermon in person. And then at the end, I can email myself those notes. So uh, to add notes to the system, um, it's super easy. You just put in your note outline um, and then wherever you want there to be a note button, you just click um, insert note editor and that's going to add a new item here. So this lets people follow along, add their own notes, and then email it to, them, to themselves. Um, one great thing about our platform is the church online aspect. So what this does is this lets you connect all of those things we just talked about, like the website builder with a block called church online, um, your latest sermon coming in from YouTube automatically when you go live. Um, you can attach the latest sermon notes that you see that we were just the salt and light notes. Um, and this lets me uh, participate in an online experience and have all of these actions I can take on the right. Like if I need prayer, I can fill out a form and get prayed for. I can um, partake in the altar call. Um, and I can also join the live chat and discussion and just uh, comment and follow along as um, the service is happening. All of this is super easy to manage. Um, one other thing that churches that are big in churches is events, right? So to add a new event, you simply give it a title. Um, you add the dates, the start time, where it's happening. You can add a registration form or any buttons. And the really cool thing is 
Um, it's going to generate a QR code for you automatically that you can print out into your material, um, hand it out to people, and it's going to link straight back to this. Um, and whenever you have an event speed on the website, whenever the event passed, it'll just automatically pull that off. Um, and, but keep this archive so it's indexable by Google, which is huge. Um, finally, we're going to look at the mobile app. So the mobile app pulls all of these features together. You can fully edit the pages just like you would a web page. Um, you can add different sections. You can control these icons. Um, you can have your church online experience, your sermon archive, prayer, all of that available in your app. And it's all managed directly through this one platform, this one interface. Um, there's so many more features. That's just like a brief overview. Um, one thing to note, we build all of the websites for you. You Sure, you can build it yourself, um, but it's included in our price. We build the website for you, and then you can send us the revisions. We'll make them. And if you really want that extended level of service, we have something called the Ultimate Plan, and that's where we become the web team of your church. So all you do each week when you want to add a sermon is just email us, email us and say, hey, the new sermon's up. Um, we'll go in, add that, make sure your series are all up to date and take care of all that for you. So that's it. If you have any questions, like I said, you can reach out to us through this chat icon um, or comment in our Facebook group. Um, we're happy to help you. Love to get you a new website going.